In this video, we will learn how to replace an originally multiple force, multiple moment load system with its equivalent and generally a lot simpler load system. Imagine this fire hydrant fixed to the ground, and there is a force F acting on it as shown. From experience, we can tell that if we replace this force by these two forces, each with half the magnitude placed symmetrically about the central axis of the hydrant, these two forces will create the same effect as the original F force. Even if we replace the forces by these three, again, they create the same effect. By same effect, I mean that the forces create the same tendency to push the fire hydrant down, and also the ground will generate the same force to support the fire hydrant, preventing it from going down. These several force systems are known to be equivalent systems. Now let's imagine the force F acts on the fire hydrant this way. Now the force creates a translational tendency to push the fire hydrant to the right. But also, it creates a clockwise rotational tendency for the fire hydrant to fall to the right. For this fire hydrant to stay still, as a response, the ground must create a force supporting the fire hydrant pointing to the left, but also a moment to cancel out the rotational effect. We can add a pair of canceling forces to this fire hydrant without changing the load status. But notice, these two forces now create a couple moment. And can be represented as. Note the cross symbol indicates that the direction of the moment vector is pointing into the screen. You can imagine an arrow shooting into the screen. Now this force still provides a translational tendency to push the fire hydrant to the right. While this couple moment creates the clockwise rotational effect on the fire hydrant as well. So again, in order to keep the fire hydrant static. The ground must create a force pointing to the left, and a counterclockwise moment to cancel out the rotational effect. So, this force moment system is equivalent system as the previous single force system. A system is equivalent if the external effects it produces on a body are the same as those caused by the original force and couple moment system. In the class of statics. Since members are not moving, we say the systems are equivalent if they induce the same support reactions at the supports. A load with multiple forces and couple moments acting on multiple locations can be replaced by a single force and a single couple moment acting on a single point. We want to do so to help calculate the support reactions. Let's imagine the fire hydrant is subjected to multiple forces and multiple couple moments acting on multiple points. We want to replace all of these by a single force and a single couple moment placed at a certain point, say point O. The single force is simply the resultant force of all these three or original forces, and is easily calculated through vector addition. For the resultant moment. We need to first calculate the individual moment caused by each force about point O. Add them together, and then add all of the free couple moments together. In this case, only two M1 and M2. And then we add the total moment caused by the forces and the total couple moments together, and this is the total moment at point O. And therefore, we replace. The original multi-force, multi-moment load system by a single-force, single-moment system acting on a single point, point O. You can do this for any arbitrary point. Note that the resultant force will always be the same, but the resultant moment will depend on what reference point you choose. In some special situation, the resultant force vector and the resultant moment vector are perpendicular to each other, as shown here. You can further reduce the moment by placing the force away from point O, say at a distance d. d equals to the magnitude of the resultant moment m r O divided by the resultant force f R. The reason is because this way force f R is creating a moment about point O that equals to f R times d, which is m r O. Therefore, this way the system is reduced to a single force system.